Interiors and Paper Artisans. It's Chandra with Stock and Stuff. I am here with the September installment of Crack, Crack, Crack the Vault, um, hosted by Poet Spice and lots of other crafter collaborators are a part of this. I missed last month, as you all know, I was moving and I just could not get my craft home unpacked. So I was really struggling this week trying to figure out what I was going to do. And so I went to my Pinterest board um, that I just keep like samples of, of projects that have dyes that I own. And this was a dye I had never used. It was in that on that Pinterest board. It is from In Love Arts, and it is um, I guess it's like a tag dye with snowflakes. And um, so one of the projects was like creating a little box out of it for tea lights. And so I cut this the larger one. There's a large one. Or both of them are pretty small, but there's one bigger than the other. It's a two piece, and um, I cut the I cut the frame, the tag itself, out of pink. Um, I'll just lift it up here, out of pink glitter paper. I don't know if you can see that shimmer. And then I um, traced it, traced the dye onto um, pink vellum, and just fussy cut it, and then trimmed it. And then I made some little uh, sides in there to kind of hold those, each of the sides together. Um, and I just cut those at um, half an inch and scored at, at um, um, a quarter of an inch, I guess. Or no, I cut them at a quarter and scored them at an eighth. That's what I did. And then I just added some snowflake bling. Um, I just had some in my stash. I just opened my Christmas box and literally one of the first things I saw and I just added that at the top and I had a tea light and had to change the battery and I put it there. I was going to do a bottom for it, but I thought, oh, it's probably better to be able to just lift it out instead of having to reach over and, you know, fear for going in it. So um, that is my little project. I kind of like it. I think I'm going to put it on the shelf on my craft desk. Um, and you know, it's something you could make more of. I wish it was bigger because you could kind of use it as some centerpiece pieces, but um, just wanted to share. And uh, I'm glad it's cooling off down here in the south. So, as I continue to unpack, I am purging as well because there's a lot of projects and things that I brought that I know I'm not going to get to when I did that organization conference this week and it made me really want to go back through all of my stuff. So I am doing that and purging because my craft room at the new house is a lot smaller than the craft room I had back in Michigan. So thanks for watching. Uh, check out the other collaborators here on YouTube on this beautiful Friday or throughout the weekend. Have a great day.